Alright, now when I was a kid, Christmas was a big deal. And nothing was more important than going to see Santa and telling them what you wanted for Christmas. Because how else are you gonna let Santa know that you want that sweet, sweet Mario Kart game for the Nintendo 64? Now granted, you could just write him a letter instead and mail it to him. Dear, Dear Santa, Santa, thank you, thank you for getting me a Nintendo, Nintendo 64, 64 last, year last year for Christmas. Christmas. However, However, I'm not I'm sure why you got me Diddy Kong, Kong Racing to go with it instead, instead of Mario, Mario Kart 64. 64. Everybody, Everybody knows Mario, Mario Kart 64 is the much better game. Seriously? What the fuck? P.S. I got you double stuffed Oreos to go with your milk this year. You know, the good shit. You can thank me later. You put your letter in the mailbox all excited and shit, but then you realize, oh yeah, that's right, I'm a dumbass little kid. I don't even got any postage on this goddamn thing. Santa's not gonna get this letter, what am I doing? So instead, you gotta go with your dumbass friends to see Santa in person. Hey, you know Santa's gonna be at the Kmart down the street today, right? What? Kmart? What the hell's Santa trying to do there? Score some smack? I have no idea, but my step Dad's taking us if you want to go. All right, you guys ready to go see Santa at the Kmart? We sure are. Everybody got their pistols with them? We sure do. All right, looks like we're ready to go to Kmart then. Let's go. So you walk into that dirty Kmart all excited and shit. Oh, uh, yeah, excuse me. My daughter and my fake son are here to see Santa Claus. Oh, is that right? Well, Santa's over by aisle 12B. You know, right next to the used syringes and the semi-automatic rifles. You can't miss them. So there we are, standing in line to see Santa Claus. I heard that when you sit on Santa's lap, he can see every bad thing that you've ever done in your whole life. Oh, yeah, right, Michael. Shut the hell up. What is Santa, a fucking sorcerer reading people's minds and shit? Meanwhile, we're watching all these kids go up there. They got these long-ass lists of all the stuff that they want for Christmas. All I want for Christmas is a pet dolphin and a grenade launcher and the state of New Mexico. They got some kids that get up there. They're scared shitless. They can't say a word because they're so damn terrified. What's the matter, son? It's Christmas. It's fun. Now go sit on this creepy old guy's lap so he can break into our house later. But not me. I was too determined to be scared. I knew you had one chance to tell Santa what you wanted, and you better make it count. Well, little girl, what would you like for Christmas? Dolphin dick. Uh, dolphin dick? Well, I guess if that's what kids are into these days. All right, little girl, you can have the dick of a dolphin. Finally, it's my turn to go see Santa. I get up there, and I am all business. Yes, Santa, I would like to return this punk-ass Diddy Kong Racing for one Mario Kart 64, please. Uh, I don't think Santa Claus does returns there, kiddo. Oh, so you're saying that I totally risked my life in this goddamn Kmart for no reason then, huh? Well, you're asking can kiss those double stuffed Oreos goodbye. So then of course it's Michael's turn to go up there. He's got his stepdad whispering shit in his ear. All right, get up there and tell him you want a big screen TV for Christmas and you want Suzanne Summers from Three's Company. And if he's not going for that, tell him we'll settle for Joyce DeWitt if we have to, but we're not happy about it. Ho, ho, ho there, little boy. Have you been a good boy for Christmas? Uh, Santa, is it true that you can see every bad thing that I've ever done in my whole life? Uh, what? No, kid, what the hell are you talking about? What am I, a fucking warlock or something? Oh, okay, good. Well, in that case, I've been a very good Good boy this year, Santa. Ah, uh, Michael, don't lie to him. You've been a dirty little bastard all year long. Yeah, why don't you tell him about the time you clogged the toilet with a goddamn G.I. Joe action figure? Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. And the time you took a shit in our own cat's litter box. Oh, yeah, I did that too. And how about the time you ate a whole tube of toothpaste and all your farts smelled like spearmint for like a week? Holy smokes, you are a dirty little bastard, aren't you? Oh, well, I guess better luck next year. Well, thanks a lot, Michael. So much for my Suzanne Summers. I guess you're just gonna have to get 10 across the ass for Christmas this year. Bruce